when you work hard for money and you earn that money and then you use it to buy things for others. Mm -hmm. that, that has a way to shape character. If you actually make them wait for celebrations or things where gifts are given, then it is so fun when they're two and three and four. I mean, they're just so excited about things. Yeah, and, and so my point in all of this was to say, hey, yeah, we've actually done this. Mm -hmm. Started it pretty early with our kids, three, four years old, um, in terms of putting an emphasis on them giving, giving. gifts. Mm -hmm. yeah. And them sacrificing in some way for the gift. So... Right, That and, okay, you don't skip over that too quick. That's such an important part of, of this. Yes. Because it's not just, hey, we want you, you know, to give a gift to your brother or sister mm -hmm. for Christmas, and here's the money. Or here's we'll the take 20 bucks. We'll take you to the toy store, pick it out, and then you wrap it up for brother or whatever. Yeah. No, a big part of this is that they're, quote unquote, paying the price. Mm -hmm. That they're, yes, that they're sacrificing something of themselves for other people, just like grandma and grandpa sacrifice to buy them the presents they receive from them. This is how we learn appreciation. This is how we learn gratitude is because we start to see, oh, all this stuff that we're given, all this, the home we live in, all these things, this is gradually that we learn this, are because of sacrifices of other people. Yeah, And, and so this can be in, in all kinds of ways, but we wanted them even at a young age to have some buy-in, even if it was a sacrifice of their time, like, no, we're going to stop and make this card or make this thing. Or Yeah, and so like at four years of age, it might be, making like a little ornament mm -hmm. to give or baking something. I mean, there's all kinds of things that they can do mm -hmm. uh, at those ages. Yeah, it doesn't necessarily have to be buying something. Although I think by the time they're four and five and they're hopefully starting to work a little bit and earn a little bit of money, that it's appropriate for them to pitch in money too. Yeah. A especially the money that they've worked for and earned and and then let them spend it on things. Yeah, there there are and the reason we do that is not because we are, you know, we need help, you know, financially or something like that. I mean, I, and I just I want people to think about the why behind that mm -hmm. because it's so good for our kids to work hard and earn money. Right, and that the 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 lesson of you know, developing a work ethic, connecting hard work with um, you know general financial success, like you see in the proverbs, that's all good stuff. Those are good lessons. But think about the lesson when you work hard for money and you earn that money, and then you use it to buy things for others. Mm -hmm. That that has a way to shape character. Right, yeah. that's one of those events, one of those behaviors, one of those moments that can really have an impact on a kid's character. Now, I, I worked hard and I earned this, and so I des I deserve it in that sense, hmm. right? Uh, I merited that, and now I'm going to take it and I'm going to use that to give a gift to someone else. That that has an impact on on character and and Paul's admonition. Right. Don't just think about your own interests, but the interests of others. Do not do nothing out of selfishness. Mm -hmm. And that this is actually one of the key ways that we find joy in life yeah. is by giving to others. And when we let kids earn or work or make something, and, and I don't mean like, I mean something they really work on. Not like a silly thing, but something that it's like, no, they really put some time into it and encouraging them to do that. And then you you give that and you see that that brings someone joy. And then the joy that you experience from that is not something you can just teach with words they, they mm. really have to experience that kind of joy when you mm. sacrifice for someone else and you see 
the blessing that it is to them. 